a season-defining call. Nothing short of that. I'm Colette Sturgis. Um, I'm a sensory room host on match day games for um, families that have got um, autistic children that can't sit outside in the crowds. I'm working in here for seven years now, which is how long it's been open. If knockout, who won it, scores it. Leicester City go to Wembley and it's the end for Watford. My name's uh, Owen Davis and I'm the Chief Executive for Level Playing Field. The purpose for a sensory room at a football club is to provide a space where they can control the environment. Uh, some people with disabilities such as uh, autism might the overstimulation of, of noise and sound and the space being kind of overcrowded. Here at Watford have a pitch facing sensory room so it still allows somebody to be able to come and watch that live sport. Look out takes! I weren't really a big football fan when I was younger and I just didn't really enjoy the experience as much. I was in the Grain Taylor stand when the sensory room started to you know, come across. Um, that's when we started using it and my mum got in contact with some people and it felt really comfortable and nice. When, when we first come into the Graham Taylor's stand, it was very busy outside, lots of fans. You'd then queue up at the turn start to get in. You'd then have to get through all the crowds of people to find your seat. Um, and then it was very noisy. Um, Kane at that time used ear defenders. It didn't give him a chance to kind of concentrate on the game and what was happening because he was so distracted. And then when we attended Sensory Room, um, we had that immediate break of the busyness. Sal Munia saves, knockout follows in, and Munia saves again! Absolutely astonishing! Uh, over our shoulders as well as some seats directly close to the sensory room which if somebody kind of comes initially first and then wants to go out and watch life sport they have the opportunity to do it there's one family that still comes through now that literally will walk through as like a safety blanket almost for them um, they sit out there they come up at half time still now here come Watford Forestieri Based like this and watching live sport, everyone's integrating, you're digesting the same thing, so you can have that I was there experience. A sensory room has helped me watch football because it helps me feel safe, comfortable, and just enjoy football in general. Here's Hawk! Do not scratch your eyes! You are really seeing the most extraordinary finish here! It almost mirrors the final day! With the very last kick of this playoff semi-final, Troy Deeney wins it for Watford and sends them to Wembley!